हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल In last video we discussed about Nazarene mountains now we are going to discussing about Nazarene plains Nazarene plains are divided into Rajasthan plains which is generally studied separate physical division of India Western plain which covers the states of Punjab and Haryana Central plains which covers the states of Uttar Pradesh, Bihar and West Bengal. Eastern Plains which covers Brahmaputra Valley and Delta region. Northern Plains are located between the north of Himalayas and south of Peninsular Plateau which is also called as Deccan Plateau. The Northern Plains are spread over an area of 7 lakh square kilometers. These are formed by the deposition of the sediments brought by three main river systems. They are the Indus River and its tributaries, the Ganga River and its tributaries, and the Brahmaputra River and its tributaries, together called as Hindu-Ganga-Brahmaputra Plains. It has 2,400 kilometers long. And its width varies from. about 300 km in the west to 150 km in the east it's mainly include the states of uttar pradesh punjab haryana bihar west bengal and assam delta region A delta is a land form created by the deposition of sediments that is carried by a river as the flow leaves its mouth and enters slow moving. To understand in simple words, when river flow greater, it carries lot of sediments and rocks. As soon as river flow enters slow moving, the sediments, rocks sand and clay in the river get deposited you will find these deltas where the speed of river is slow deltas usually occur when river enters oceans seas and lakes etc in india we have deltas like sundarban delta where ganga and brahmaputra rivers meet Sundarban Delta is home to the Royal Bengal Tigers and it is the world largest and fastest growing delta. We also have deltas like Godavari Delta, Krishna Delta, Mahanadi Delta and Kaveri Delta. Nazarene Plain is one of the largest plain and most fertile plains of the world it has major crops such as wheat sugarcane rice jute oil seeds and pulses are grown here Based on the relief features northern plains can be divided into following regions They are Babur Terai Bangar and Khader What is Babur After descending from the mountains the rivers deposit pebbles in a narrow belt is known as babur the width of this belt is about 8 to 16 kilometers long and it lies parallel to shivaliks all the streams are disappeared in this region terai terai lies towards the south of babur belt 
you can easily understand first we have shivaliks and parallel to shivaliks we can see barber belt and south of the barber belt we have terai in this region the streams reappear which disappear in barber region and make swampy and marshy region swampy is nothing but a wetland whose dominant vegetation is trees and woody plants marshy is nothing but a wetland with other forms of vegetation dominant bagar and kadar now we are going to learn difference between bagar and kadar bagar is a island composed of old alluvial soil whereas kadar is a low land composed of new alluvial soil Bagar is always above the level of flood plains. Kadar is flooded almost every year. It is often impregnated with calcareous concretions known as kankar. It is often characterized by clayey soil which is very fertile. This is not suitable for cultivation. Intensive agriculture is practiced here. Regional divisions of northern plains. We have three divisions of northern plains. They are Punjab plains, Ganga plains, and Brahmaputra plains. Punjab plains. Punjab plains forms the western part of Nazran plains. It is bounded by Rajasthan desert in the south and Shivalik range in the north, Pakistan in the west and Delhi region in the east. It is formed by the river Indus and its tributaries like River Jhelum, River Chenab, River Ravi, River Bees, and River Satluj. Dobawas abound in this plain. Dobab is nothing but the land between the two rivers. For example, here we can see River Jhelum. and river chanab and the land between these two rivers is known as dawab we have five dawabs of punjab they are sind sagar dawab jag dawab rachna dawab wadi dawab pis dawab ganga plains Ganga plains are divided into three parts. They are Upper Ganga plains, Middle Ganga plains, and Lower Ganga plains. This plain extends between Sagar and Tista rivers. The natural states lie in the Ganga plain are Haryana, Delhi. Uttar Pradesh Bihar and parts of Jharkhand and West Bengal Brahmaputra plains This plain form the eastern part of Nadran plain and lies in Assam and Brahmaputra river passes through this plains The Indian desert The desert region lies western margin of Arvalli hills called Thar desert. It is the ninth largest desert in the world. It is dotted with sand dunes and bakens. A sand dune is a mound or ridge of sand formed by the winds in desert. The shape of the dune is depend on the movement of the winds in desert. The vegetation cover is low with thorny bushes. collection of dunes is called dune belt that desert covers 
large parts of Rajasthan and small parts of Gujarat. Desert region is divided into two parts that are Marustali and Bagar. Bagar refers to semi-arid region whereas Marustali refers to arid region. It receives less than 150 millimeters of rainfall every year. Marustali is actual desert region. It stretches from Ran of Kutch up to Punjab and Ariana. It has 650 kilometers long and 300 kilometers width. Bagar region further subdivided into Luni Basin because this region is streamed by river Luni and its tributaries. Luni is the main river of this area. This part is Shekavati region. This is the region of Shekavati Rajputs. This part is known as Gagak Plain because river Gagak terminates in this region which is rises in outer Himalayas that is Shivalik. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon down below.